Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for, what is it? Oh, around the 28th, Happy Thanksgiving. For those of you that celebrate, we're just going to see what comes up. Now, keep in mind, the timing is fluid, so <laughs> a lot of people didn't hear that, but a lot of people did. Anyhow, timing is fluid. What do we got? What do, message do I have for today? Or tomorrow, or the next day, or next week, or whatever the case is. What do I got? Oh, we have a we have a woman here, a feminine that sees herself as a victim. Okay, this is a victim mentality. This is somebody who likes to blackmail. Okay, and tries to set people up. Uh, this person is not emotionally balanced. They're not very kind, jealous, selfish, childish, big baby. We got a big baby here. <laughs> the devil reversed. So this is taking back control, trying to restore control. Now this is freedom. This, it could be emotional, okay? The queen, the queen of Cups in reverse could be an emotional time. There could be some ties that are severed, okay? This is severing ties. This is a bond that is breaking, and it could be emotional. So there could be, a, you know, a severing of ties that is emotional. Oh, my God. There probably is a, a severing of ties that is emotional, okay? Could be a breakup, could be a split. There's a disconnection. There's disharmony. There's, there's, uh, there could be some bullying. We could have some bullying here. We could have a bully. There could be a definitely an argument or something. Somebody is in an unhealthy situation. It looks like the chains are, are being broken. And there is a, a union that is... You know, they're going to be an argument or a split or something like that. This person, um, <laughs> this could be anybody. It doesn't matter what sign it is. This is somebody who is very emotional and doesn't, doesn't think that anything is ever their fault. It's not my fault. You know, we talked about this the other day. I didn't do anything. No way. <laughs> That's what we got there. Anyhow. Um, somebody's going to be facing some sort of challenge. Mm. So, we have a bond that is breaking. We do. We have a bond that is breaking. There's no growth. It's unrealistic. Somebody is really dissatisfied. This is too much. There's been a painful separation or there's going to be a painful separation. There could be some, definitely be some tears that are, that are going to happen. Okay. We got somebody here that is, is trying to do too much. And it's unrealistic. Uh, holding on to too much and it's definitely, this is unrealistic. It is totally unrealistic. Somebody has been holding on to a situation that isn't healthy as well. But I think that this there's, there's going to be some sort of argument or breakup or something. Something, something. <laughs> Obviously, right? This is some, this is determination. 
somebody has is being determined to do something determined to break up determined to break up a union this person may be determined to break up a union maliciously vindictively we could have a vindictive person that is very malicious childish big baby doesn't like it when they don't get their way this person is determined somebody may be determined to break up a union but it's not realistic they're trying to do too much this there's there's relationship problems here there is relationship problems there could be a child that is leaving or a child that has left. That's the meaning of this card. There's also a change in the home, on the home front, perhaps, or in the family dynamics. There could be a, a big change. There's a completion here, no matter what. We have these two tens. Something is coming to an end. A burden within the family is coming to an end. Okay? A burden is coming to an end. Now, this is a card of working together. The Three of Pentacles working together. Teamwork. It looks like we have a priest here. Hmm. Somebody could be... Oh, something to do with a priest. Something to do with a church collaborating with a church or something and I don't usually see that with this card but it really strikes out at me this priest this is putting in effort to work together somebody may be putting in effort to prove themselves or something like that somebody is working really really hard uh, to make something grow that is already dead it's dead it's a dead, it's dead, it's dead. So it's dead. This union is already done. Okay, there's no relationship growth, there's no happiness, it's there's no uh compatibility here, it's toxic, it's unhealthy. We have somebody here that has been trying really, really hard to make it work. They have. They've been really trying hard to make it work, but I feel like something is going to happen. Something is going to happen because this bond is going to break. This is, I'm telling you what, with that devil reverse, there is a bond that is going to break or has been broken. It's like the ties are finally being severed. Instantly, the ties are being severed. There could be a fallout. Okay, there could be a fallout at a family gathering or whatever. There could be a family feud even. Oh, goodness gracious. Somebody's getting going, getting probably get growing weak or losing their strength. Somebody's going to be receiving a message that they don't want to hear. Or there's going to be a conflict. There's going to be a fight. There's going to be an upcoming celebration as well. There's definitely going to be some upheaval. If somebody could fall down. They're carrying something. Maybe they're carrying wood. They could be carrying wood. Or they're carrying something. And they trip and they fall. Just saying. I don't know. Think something is going to come to a complete halt with this Knight of Swords reversed. Somebody is dealing with an untrustworthy individual who doesn't care who they hurt. This person has been, it's almost like this person has ill intentions and they've been trying to, this is somebody who is very malicious. We definitely have a malicious individual here that is causing upheaval, probably within the family. 
They may be working together with some people, you know, trying to break something up. Very upset. Somebody is going to get very upset. God is here, or a higher power. So there is a higher power involved here. It feels as though there is somebody's family tradition that is not going to go as planned. I think there's going to be a conflict. <laughs> it's pretty common for the holidays, isn't it? <coughs> there's going to be a big argument. Somebody's going to get really upset. They may lose their focus. They may lose their concentration. They may not be able to master their emotions. There could be some anger. There could be a, a bout of anger, an explosion of anger. It could be an explosion anywhere. There could be a lot of tears that are going to come up. I feel as though... There is, there is, there's a marriage that is on the rocks or there is a commitment that is on the rocks. There is some, there's a breakup here. There is severing ties and there, but this is a priest as well. Something to do with a priest. There could be an upcoming uh, church celebration. I mean, there could even be a funeral coming. I'm, I just, I saw that way back and I'm going to say it again. I mean, I didn't say it, but I was thinking it. It feels like we've got a funeral that is coming. There's going to be a funeral. This is an upcoming celebration that happens unexpectedly. Perhaps it's time. This could also be a confession. Somebody may be confessing something. Six of Wands reverse. Now this is no progress. Somebody is still in the middle of a battle. It's going to, it's definitely going to be a battle filled day. Somebody's going to be right in the battlefield. Okay. I hate to tell you all that, but I think that this, within the next day or two, there's going to be some sort of argument or fight that causes uh, a lot of upheaval, a lot of upheaval. And I think that, uh, There's going to be an unexpected celebration right around the corner. It could be at a church. Okay, somebody could be getting married or they could be it could be an anniversary party, it could be a funeral. Okay? There's going to be an up upcoming celebration at a uh I think it's a church. I think that we have somebody here that is is uh weak, okay? And they may be trying to do too much and I think that there's definitely an overwhelming Somebody is very overwhelmed with that Ten of Wands, with a family or with a relationship, and it's like they just can't do it anymore. This is too much. It definitely is too much. There's no progress. There's no victory here. There's no success. This is a this is a real battle zone. It's a real war zone. I, I, I see. I see that it is a war zone. There's a lot of wounds here that have been unable to heal, and I think that um, there's definitely a lack of healing and there's some ties that are about to be severed with a person that is vicious. I think we got a vicious individual who is, um, well, she may think that she's vicious, but she's actually very immature and childish and doesn't know how to love. Okay, so the viciousness comes from her own childhood, whoever this person is. It comes from her lack of love when she was a child. <laughs> So that's why she acts the way that she does. So we have somebody up here that's an instigator. This person is instigating um, a whole lot of drama. She's a drama queen. Okay, this is your drama queen right here. So yeah, we have a drama queen that is um, going to or is causing problems within a family dynamic. And I feel as though it's going to cause somebody to be really overwhelmed and... Uh, they may end up following whoever this person that they are uh, making f 
they're making somebody feel like really upset. They're making somebody really upset. I feel like this person is, is going to lose their balance. Okay. This is lose loss of balance. This is loss of balance. Somebody's going to lose their balance in their concentration and they could fall down and, um, whatever. Um, now this is an end of heartache, the end of heart pain with the three of swords reversed. I think that this, that, uh, it's time to heal. It's time to move on. It's time to release the past hurts. It's time to let go of the past hurts. I definitely see tears in the next couple of days. I do feel like there's, there is some sort of divine guidance here with the, with the hair font. Um, I feel like somebody is going to get the, the, uh, epiphany or notion or guidance that they need that says, you know, it's time to go your own way. It's time to go. It's time to listen. It's time to believe in yourself. I, I mean, this is, are you listening? Are you listening? It's time. It's time. It's time. Whatever that means. So, um, there is going to be an upcoming celebration. This it is going to be a celebration, but you at this celebration, <laughs> there's arguments. Okay, there is arguments. It's not good. It is not good. So be prepared for a fight. Good luck.